All right, guys, so I'm going to show you how to update your PS5 controller. Now, if an update is available, then it's going to say it boot up. But if you skip that, then you're going to have to wait for 24 hours. Or if you want, so if you don't want to wait for 24 hours, again, you can wait 24 hours. Or you can go into your settings and then go to network. So you're just going to turn this off right here. And then go down to system. And then go to the date and time. So we're just going to put the clock ahead uh, one day. So set manually. And we'll just put it to the 15th. All right, so from here, just make sure you confirm it. So from here, we're going to restart the system. All right, so we're just going to turn off the system. And it's going to turn it back on. All right, cool. So the message is back. From here, you use the USB-C, the USB-A cable, uh, which ship with the system. So it's putting the USB-C right here. And the USB-A goes right here. Yep, so it's gonna press update now. Okay, and for the last step, just turn your network back on. Uh, the clock will automatically adjust back. And yeah, guys, order is to it. So hopefully this helped out.